Welcome back, sports gamers. It's been a little while since I've dropped the Madden 19 tip for you guys, um, but I came across something that I was just um, in the lab with, and I found something actually in the Green Bay playbook uh, out of this pistol strong slot open. Now, this is in several other playbooks like um, the pistol playbook and some others, but this, this particular play is only in Green Bay. It's the only place you can find it in the game, in the Green Bay playbook. Um, so the pistol strong slot open, and what you wanna do is you want to make sure you have twin halfback. And the play is the cross weak flood. Now this play, it's it's a very good play. Everyone knows the crossing routes are tough to guard this year. You know, when they go all across the field, the other side, zones don't always pick them up or pick them up effectively. So you have that, the uh, post route going all the way across the field, that is that deep crossing route. Then you have a shorter, shallower crossing route in the play. And then you have the double move on the left-hand side. Um, but the, the, the route that's most most deadly out of this everything is the uh, is they're actually the running back fullback route you see and this play just absolutely positively just destroys cover three so even if I don't even call cover three max let's do this just call uh, uh, we could just call regular cover three I'm looking for skies cover three sky all you have to do is put the running back on a wheel route and any cover three will match and will leave and you can block the other running back. It will leave the, the fullback wide open. That's why you want to put a, a halfback there. The faster, the better, um, because you get down the field wide open. As you can see, no one guards the running back apps at all. And any cover three you call, I'll go through all of them, the running back is left wide open. You can block the tailback to give you more time in the pocket. You guys know practice mode, you get no time more. When your quarterback just misses a wide open throw like that. So any cover three is gonna leave it's gonna leave the, the fullback wide open like that because they're gonna match and they're gonna leave that fullback open. So what you wanna do, so let's take a look at versus um another cover three. Let's see, let's see they do hard uh hard flats. So now if you do cover three, let's say they do the hard flat only difference is with this you just have to wait to the running back clears the hard flat and he's still gonna be wide open down the sidelines because the the uh, the the cornerback is gonna match and then run with him. and you can see that the cornerback is going over matches the post takes him out and leaves it wide open the fullback who we have a halfback sub there all right, so the first thing people are going to say All right, so one of the things people are going to say is if what if they play to the sticks, which a lot of people do, um, they'll play to the sticks, so it turns all matching uh, principles and rules off so that's fine the cornerback will stay there but you have to remember that you still have the deep crossing route which, so the, the cornerback is going to stay but then you have the deep crossing route that's going to get wide open so you definitely have to pick their poison on that one so if they match And pick up the uh, which, which uh, I, I forgot to match on this one. So it's gonna leave the fullback wide open. So anytime they don't match, that's gonna be wide open. Just to show you there. So if they do, and I don't this time, these two controllers. So if they do um, decide to match. Then all you have to do again is wait. Run the cross all the way across the field. And he's gonna be wide open. And there's all sorts of things you can do um, with this. You can I, I really don't like the post move, the double move post. It doesn't it gets open a little bit, it's just not consistent, like it's just not consistent. So I, I really don't like to throw that usually. Um, I pretty much stick to reading the fullback. And there's different things you can do with the halfback. You can swing them out. 
Um, so all sorts of cool things you can do. Uh, sometimes you can even streak this guy on the slot receiver, throw it. Let's so basically, you know, you see how it beats cover two. Let's see um, some of the other coverages that you guys will see. Uh, so I give you, you know, make sure you get to play. Uh, how to beat everything, pretty much. So let's see Tampa two. All right, now facing the cover two, uh, people will, you typically will put the linebacker in the middle third and maybe spy a, a DT or in, so you can't take off the quarterback. So what you want to do in this case uh, is just streak the X receiver or slot guy. And he's going to clear it out, and then if you just wait, the running back will actually clear the cornerback, and you'll have him down the sideline uh, in the same way. And it's key, and the most important thing is, of course, you have an accurate quarterback, but you also, if you have a, two good halfbacks or a halfback with good speed, then, you know, Kevin Coleman is a, is a blazer. So the faster the halfback, you know, the better in that case. All right, now you're facing a cover four look. And in the cover four, it has anything that has that those same type of matching principles uh, or those, the purple or the cloud flats, they're going to match the, this, this crossing route the same way. And they're gonna leave the running back or fullback wide open. So it's gonna be pretty much the same way. They're gonna have to either play the cloud flats there, or they're gonna have to uh, turn uh, play the sticks, which will turn the matching off completely. Yeah, even though I totally messed that up, you see this how effective that cross around just gets open no matter what. So versus the cloud flats, you can see how I set it up here. In the same way, either you wait till the running back clears him. Still gonna be open, or you wait to the crossing route. So even with regular, let's say, uh, let's say they play to the sticks. So play to the sticks with turns matching off. Even with that, it doesn't go with them. But I still have the running back deep, and I still have the crossing route across the field if Matt Ryan decides he wants to show up and uh, be accurate for that day. So either way, you're going to have both still. You're going to have the running back or you're going to have the crossing route. They have to, they're going to have to check one of them. One of them is going to be open. Why pretty much as open as you get. Alright, so the last one. Um, and it's the same thing like cover six, all the other variations of cover two and four, it all works the same way. Um, let's take a look at man coverage. And for man coverage, of course there's a man on that fullback position now. So he won't, he won't be able to just, he's not gonna be wide open, he's gonna be covered. But this post, that post on the right side just destroys man. So versus man coverage, you're not going to be able to have that fullback wide open the same way, but you're going to have that post that really is on. It just gets open. It just totally beats man pretty badly to the inside pretty much every time. Even if I play inside on my corner, it's still not going to make a difference. That post just beats man so badly over and over and over again. So you say, okay, well, what if that person just checks that one? So at the same time, you know, you can have a crossing route, fullback and all that. And you can still have a crossing route. I mean, you got the slant coming from the other side. And versus the blitz, I mean, really, you know, you can just block. It's still two running backs back there, you know. So you can just block and pretty much have these guys go all the way across the field. And these, these here, the, you can leave the double mold move. I don't like it versus the blitz. It just takes too long. Just put them on a slant. Um, and you can just, all day, you can hit that uh, that post. Just any type of man coverage. Um, you know, that they have to check that post. It's going to get open every single time versus any kind of man 
Uh, if your quarterback can make the throw, you're gonna be able to hit that all day. They literally have to check that. It's pretty much the play. If you want to see some other uh, things that I run in this set, let me know in the comments below. I will do like a whole uh, breakdown and show uh, all the plays out of this formation that I run to pair with this that make it uh, you know, a pretty effective set. So uh, let me know in the comments below what you guys think. As always, make sure you like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more Madden 19 tips. Here, SEO. It's a natural. I'm out.